Welcome to today's video. Today we'll be looking at the Olite Arcfeld Pro and helping you answer if this is good enough to be in your EDC. I picked up this light back in November and I've been carrying it uh, daily. Uh, the box, so it does come in both cool white and neutral white options. And it has um, a white light, a green laser, and a UV light. And for turbo, which is 1300 lumens, uh, will run for four minutes. High is 420 lumens and will run for 135 minutes. Medium is 100 lumen and will run for nine hours and 45 minutes. Low is 15 lumen, will run for 55 hours. And moonlight is one lumen and runs for 11 days. So if we look in the box, you're going to get the quick instructions. Now the light does come locked out, so you have to unlock it uh, the first time you unpackage it. It comes with the charging cable, a uh, manual, which is a standard good well, I manual that has all the instructions on how to uh, use the light and all its features. Safety warnings and the charging cable. So we look at the light. First, you notice it has four LEDs for battery charge uh, when it's in lockout mode, which you hold it uh, for five seconds. It'll show one red LED. This also is if it has less than 10% of battery but holding it again for another four seconds will unlock it. It has a mode selector to pick between the UV laser and uh, the white light. Uh, let's take a look at the UV light. Uh, is actually quite bright. Um, it's hard to probably tell here, but it does uh, work very well. It's roughly 50% brighter than the Arcfeld UV and has come in very handy. I travel a lot for work, so I do use it to check hotel rooms and make sure that they're clean. And I have three dogs, so uh, it's useful to help find pet stains and making sure that they're uh, fully cleaned up. Uh, the laser, it's a green laser, is a uh, 5 milliwatt laser which is roughly 12 times more powerful than the Arkfeld Laser's 0.39 milliwatt laser. What is also nice about the, the lasers, if you double press, you can turn the light on and you can go through the low, medium, and high settings. And then in the uh, flashlight mode, holding it for two seconds will turn on moonlight mode, and then holding for two more seconds will rotate between... Uh, high, medium, and low. Now, uh, you can choose in the settings if you want uh, triple or double press to be the strobe. Um, I use double press for my strobe, and I used uh, three presses for uh, turbo. And you see turbo is quite bright. It's 1300 lumen. Uh, it would definitely light up a, a dark room. The light outputs a maximum of 2600 candela. Uh, and has a throw of about 102 meters. I've been very happy with this light. I do carry it every day. Um, I really like the pocket clip. Uh, so you see the pocket clip has a big rounded uh, area here, so it slides easily into the pocket. The flat design does also help make it lay in the pocket very well. It does have a reversal pocket clip, which you can then put on a, a bill of a hat if you wanna use it hands-free. Uh, the light has a magnetic base. Um, and it is a very strong magnet, so it will stick to any ferrous metal. And you'll be able to use that to stick under a, a hood of a car or to hook it to something that um, where you want to use the, the light hands-free. The charging, um, or jump up to a video here to show um, the light charging uh, with the USB tester. But it basically charges at 5 volts, 1 amp uh, max. If we weigh the light, we can see it weighs 3.9 ounces or roughly 111 grams. Uh, it's a fairly light light, so it does, with the flat design, go into your pocket and pretty much melt away. If we look at the uh, measurements here, we can see that it is just over one inch wide 
is about 0.63 inches uh, deep and the length is uh, 4.7 inches. So I do think it is a, a really good light you should use for your um, EDC. Again, it's become my number one used light. Um, I will also put here a quick video showing the unit running in turbo mode and showing how the temperature got to a maximum of about 105 degrees Fahrenheit after three minutes. Uh, so the light doesn't really get that hot and makes it very easy to use uh, even in its brightest settings. So I do think you would find this really useful to be part of your EDC if you need, um, especially a laser for work. Um, I do use a laser at work for presentations. I also use it to um, do inspections. And because you can turn on the light at the same time, it makes it very easy to use it in dark rooms um, during inspections. So I highly recommend the Arcfell Pro as an EDC. Um, you can go to the olightstore.com website. I will put a link in the description. If you're a first time Olight buyer, it'll get you a $10 reward. The light retails for $99. Uh, thanks for watching the video all the way through.